We are here in Arusha, Tanzania, testing and implementing our human-powered water well drill. People have to walk a long ways to get water. It takes them a big part of their day gathering it and transporting it. As we went to these villages and were able to see wells that they were using and see the constant need for water, it helped us understand that we were doing something really important. We were able to connect up quickly in Tanzania with some local well drillers. A bunch of guys turned up in my office a week ago now and sort of blew my mind a little bit with their, uh, what they're coming in to do and I admire that very much. It's one thing to drill a hole, it's another to find out where the water is. With his help we were able to find locations where we knew that water was there. Every time we drilled we had a lot of people come and watch and they would just sit there on the grass. It was probably funny for them to see a group of Americans there with this big contraption drilling. And There is no other drill that uses human power and industrial components like our drill. And I like the idea that villagers can get involved and that may not just produce water, it may take them further that they realize there is some future for them. At the end of our trip it was exciting. We were drilling in a farm of sandy soil and 70 feet down when we unhooked the pipes there was a small geyser and that was evidence to us that we are successful. It was the payoff moment to see that water coming up and see the smiles on everyone's faces and know that we had found clean water.